Good morning, everybody. Oh, <laughs> good morning, everybody. It's uh, nice to be back here. Happy Monday. Hope you guys are all doing well. Uh, as you know, we're, this is Coffee Talk with uh, HFNC. It's Don Mark, the executive director. And on the other side is Ashley, our associate director. Uh, we're here just to give you guys uh, just another quick update on what's up, to, what's up and coming. Um, and yeah, just jumping right in. I'm sure you've heard this a couple of times. Hopefully you're getting our emails uh, registering. But on May 5th, we have our Spring Fest, our Family Education Day at Great America down in Santa Clara at 9 a.m. Um, again, very excited, a full day of education followed by a full day um, or full afternoon in Great America, riding all those rides, just enjoying time with friends and family. Um, just a quick keynotes. Uh, you know, you must live in one of our service counties. If you don't know if you do, uh, just go over to our website um, and check our service areas there. Um, one person in your in the household must have a bleeding disorder, um, and we're making a maximum of four people, uh, three persons that live in that household plus uh, that one person. Um, again, at least has a bleeding disorder. Um, all four of you can have bleeding disorders, and that, that's perfectly fine as well. Um, and you, uh, just because you registered does not necessarily mean that you will be in attendance um, because again, it is limited spacing. So you'll be notified on April 19th, uh, if, whether or not you're registered. So be on the lookout for that. But again, uh, sign up uh, as quickly as possible, as soon as possible, um, just so we can get those those numbers out. Um, Ashley, you want to, you know, kind of jump in or do, do you want to just get finished going on with mine? Yeah, no, that sounds it. great. And uh, by the way, hold that cup up again. That's an yeah. incredible cup. I love that. Yeah. <laughs> COVID, right? you always have to, you always have to remember, no matter, even though we've been doing it for four years, yes. the whole uh, Zoom life, sometimes you just forget. <laughs> I do. I certainly Every do. day it happens. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So um, we're so glad that we can host a World Hemophilia Day event on Wednesday. Uh, April 17th, so that's this Wednesday, in a couple days, and it's going to be in Walnut Creek at Fleming Steakhouse, yum, and that's also going to be in English and Spanish, and our new executive director is going to be there you get to meet Mark, so that would be a wonderful opportunity if you haven't met him already, and uh, we're, that is hosted by Sanofi, we're very grateful to them, and so you just go to hemofoundation.org, and you can register right there on our landing page. Um, the second thing that we have, I'm so excited about this, we've had a couple of them already, are men's events on April 28th, and this one is going to be at Dave and Buster's, which is in Milpitas, so there's going to be some game cards, there's a virtual reality, reality package, blah, <laughs> hmm. and um, uh, we're very grateful to Octopharma for sponsoring that, and then Mosey Williams, uh, our social worker, will also be facilitating a rap session. And we have a guest speaker, Seth Rajani. So lots going on in that men's event. It's from 11 to three, again, Dave and Buster's, Milpitas, all free. And you just go to our website, hemofoundation.org to register. Um, did you want me to tell about the last thing? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, we have one more event coming up that is on uh, May 16th. And that's in Fresno for all of our people that live down in our a uh, lower part of our service area, there's something for you too. We've got dinner and education and it's going to be at the Manhattan Steakhouse and that's from six to 8.30. And this uh, topic is about people who develop inhibitors and need an alternative uh, treatment. So that's information that we all need. And uh, you're welcome to attend that Thursday, six to 8.30, May 16th. And that's uh, from our friends at Chemo Biologics. We're very grateful to them. And so I know you've got something else to share. Yeah, yeah. So, thank you, Ashley. I got. We have so many upcoming events. Uh, we're super excited. We thank our our partners, our industry partners, for putting on these programs for our community. Uh, please uh, attend as as many as you can. Um, you know, just to reconnect with uh, you know, your friend with our friends, with the community, learn something new. I'm excited to meet everyone who's coming to these uh, events this Wednesday um, in, in Walnut Creek with, San, with Sanofi. Uh, so I'm looking forward to it. The last thing uh, I do want to make sure I do want to mention, last but not least, is Camp Emotion. Obviously, you know that's it's camp doesn't need an introduction. Um, it's from June 23rd to June 29th at Camp Oakhurst in course uh, Gold, California. Uh, so camp is right around the corner. It'll be here before we know it. Uh, so we really just want to encourage everybody to who's interested, campers, adult counselors, 
assistant counselors, junior counselors. So please sign up, uh, please go through the application process. Uh, we have our wonderful um, wonderful uh, camp uh, team members, uh, Pedro and Nick, you may receive a phone call from them, just trying to check in, see if they can provide any information about the application. Um, definitely need you, definitely would love for people to fill out their application as soon as possible, just so we can get accurate headcounts. Um, and we're also looking for volunteers um, in the infirmary, around the camp, uh, people for chaperones, for the buses, a lot of opportunities to get involved in camp. Uh, so please, uh, if you see the emails and go back, um, if you're interested in saying you're, you're a camper or a counselor, uh, please, please fill out the application um, as soon as possible. We'd love to get you marked down for that. Um, that's everything from my end. Um, Ashley, was there any uh, final things? Any other, you know, I saw that your red cup is uh, yes, uh, talking to you. Yes, yeah, there's so. one more thing, but I also just wanted to mention, you know, before I came on staff here, those volunteer opportunities for, for camp were golden. And so uh, if anybody has any hesitations, uh, it's it's one of the best things you'll you'll ever do. So uh, give give it a try. Yeah. Uh, but we just want to say um, a, a, a warm kickoff to our Bayer plant, who is going to be starting their walk team this week uh, on World Hemophilia Day. So we're very grateful to them. They fundraise for us every year. So uh, go Bayer team, yeah. and, and good luck on your walk launch. Yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you, Ashley. Thank you, Bayer, for your continuous support of the foundation. And we, along with all of our industry partners, none of, of, of you know, our programming, um, the breadth of it uh, would not be uh, possible. So we thank you all for your support of the, for the foundation. Great. All right. Have a great day, everyone. See you next week.